Hey guys, Jason here. So what I want to do today is do a quick video on my Missouri wind and solar turbines. Here's one of them right there, my little 500 water. Still going good and in strong. That's like the... Uh, excuse my limping around because I busted up my leg real good this January. This last January. But there it is, still going good. Um, so that one is the very first tail that uh, Missouri Wind and Solar ever sold with that new tail design. Works good on the little 500. I love the uh, Generation 4 blades too. You'll see all of my turbines are using those. Uh, there's the other one. The, uh, my original, very first Missouri Wind and Solar Turbine. Put that up there, I think that's over, uh, over 10 years old. 11 years now? Maybe more. I'm not sure exactly. It's been quite a while. So, another, another great turbine. Uh, still working. Still doing its thing. Just saying, uh, if you're wanting to buy a small wind turbine, uh, as far as my experience goes, it's like you're going to want to get uh, a Missouri wind and solar. Here we go. This is this one up here. It's my favorite one. I love this one. Uh, I made a video about it a while ago. I call it the spider. Let's come back here so you can see it. That's my Freedom 2 PMG uh, 1224 volt. And that's been up there for a really long time too. Let's see here. That's Rev uh, 11 blade generation 4 set. Uh, the black ones and then I painted the tail Black and put red stripes on it and stuff. It's really cool It's a great turbine that thing's a really <laughs> Really good high uh, high output But anyway if you're gonna buy a uh, wind turbine I recommend uh, Missouri wind and solar They're a great turbine um, They last a long long time <laughs> alrighty guys thanks for watching uh, talk to you later